evening, Governor Ahil. Well, um, my name is Ella. I joined TIP last year. Okay, I'm actually sharing this for a lot of us to actually be encouraged. I was the mother. Can I speak without this? Yes. Yeah. I was the mother that could not connect with her children. When coach says some people are coming from a lot, a lot, a lot. Add a lot and a lot. Five times on my own. I had children that I cringe when they hug me. I had children I could not go and lie on the bed with. I had children I could not play with. I love them. God knows I do. But I could not connect because I was coming from a lot. So I have a friend, Dr. Joy. She, introduced, she gave me a book, Connect to Correct, to read. And after I read that book, I think I maybe the, my tears are still on the pages of her book. Ooh. I cried my life in, out on that book and I was like, where, where has this person been? I have been in this city and I have not known this. I, I knew some things, but some things were falling apart. So that was when I went to coach, Coach's office to buy the book and I met her coincidentally. We took a picture that I saved and from there I started following the um, Tuesday live and the Thursday um, was the call. Now fast forward to my time in the inner circle. Can you still hear me? Yes. Fast forward to my time in the inner circle. So I got to the month of January where you year one are coming into. Okay. Connect or correct. When you get to that place, the book reviews and I try to see what I'm supposed to do with my child. Coach, I will not lie. I struggle. You know when your son will come to you and they want to know rubber from you and the you, you are running. You are running from your own child and I'll be like, Coach said we should not do this. So I try but I could not. So some of you will try and you cannot, but do not give up. When they come, even if you are like this, just put your hand like this and just tell them, I love you, I love you, until you get to the point where you begin to flow. Fast forward down the years, we um, the months, we got through a lot of um, webinars, we did a lot of things, and I started to try to implement, I'm not going to lie, I didn't do 100%. But the little I could do, one day my son walked up to me, and he said, Mommy, I just want to tell you that I love you. And I'm like, wow. I love you is not something we say in my house. It's not, we don't do it. We don't do that. Mm. You know, they, we, what do they call it? We go better. How would you? We are all right. Coach, we don't that okay. Yeah. Exactly, we don't that okay. So we don't used to do that. And when he said that and he hugged me, it was like a wall inside of me just came down crumbling. My question I ask myself is this, where would I have been if I didn't join TIP? Who would have taught me that legacy is something that I can keep for my children to come? Who would have showed me the way to say, in fact, I told myself I don't want to cry here, so I'm not going to cry. So coach, thank you. If she had not answered the call, <laughs> there would have been blood on the altar. <laughs> But I just want to thank you for answering the call, for helping us. Some people will say we paid money, but we know that the money that we paid does not, the impact that we are seeing, the money does not come majority. So, thank you.